Good morning and happy Monday. I'm coming to you this morning from Fall River, Fall River Spring in Bend, Oregon. And I want to start by just let's get comfortable and close our eyes. Make sure you're cross-legged or you have a blanket or you're sitting in a chair and you're comfortable for the next 15 to 20 minutes. Let's start by just taking some natural breathing, 10 natural breaths, and we're gonna tune in to the sound of the river. As you're taking these breaths, just keep noticing the feel of the air going in and out your nostrils. Focus on the sound of the river. sound of nature, the sound of the earth. I happen to be at the mouth of the spring where the water is bubbling up straight from the earth. It's taking a moment of gratitude for earth, for Mother Earth and all that she provides us with. Fresh water, earth to be on, to ground on, and feel yourself grounding into earth no matter where you are, even if you're on a third story building. Feel your tailbone in your seat. Feel roots going into the earth. And feel that glowing red ball that we always like to talk about in your root chakra. Feel it expanding. This is your safety, your connection, your earth. This is what roots you to earth. Let's take some more breaths in through the nose. Hold for four. Out for four. Hold out for four. In for four. Hold for four. Out. Hold out. In. One more cycle. And in. And on the beginning of this beautiful week, let's tap into all the possibilities that lie ahead of us how we get to create our world, create how our day goes, and start with attitude. How am I approaching my day? Am I grateful for waking up in a comfortable bed, for the water that flowed freely from my tap while I splashed my face for the bathroom that was available to me for the warm room I'm sitting in at the moment all the creature comforts that we get to experience usually taking them for granted And how blessed we are to have this life, to have the people in our life that love us, 
and the people that we love. So with a breath and out, let's move up to the sacrum, the orange sacral chakra. Your sexuality, your desire, your self-confidence. Feel that glowing ball of orange. And now with a breath in and out, we move up to the solar plexus, the yellow ball. Expand it with your breath and out. Power, will, determination, decision. I can, I will, I do have the power to achieve my goals to attract abundance, to allow the perfect things that I'm calling in to unfold gently and lovingly for me with grace and ease. Light a little fire in there for today so that everything that you've been imagining for yourself, for your people you love, for your community, for the world at large. Light a little fire for all those things to come in. And just knowing that because you desire it and because you're saying it is so, that it can and will happen. Now let's move up to the heart chakra. Deep breath, expanding the heart. Water flowing freely behind us, carrying away anything that we no longer need. Seeing this green ball light up, light up all the chakras. Light up the heart, expand out to the world. Feel the love that's all around you. The love you have to give. The love that you can receive. Feel it coming in so gracefully and easily. Another deep breath. Moving up to the throat chakra. Light blue ball expanding and radiating out in all directions. Communication with ease and grace. Creativity. And you know, we're going to hear sounds, the sounds of the world around us. The world is happening all the time. We can't always find complete silence, but we can find moments of stillness, moments of dropping in. So using any sound you hear as a sound of exclamation, like a bell ringing when you say a truth. A glass drops on the floor and you say, oh wow, that's a confirmation that what I was saying is right on. You hear a sound in the background, a loud noise, someone practicing target practice, just an exclamation of all is well, I'm on the right track, and there's a whole beautiful world around me happening every moment through life through death, through any tragedy, through any joy, the world continues to go on and on. The planet continues to spin. And so with that, we decide, since the world's spinning anyway, since life's going on anyway, let me make a choice in this moment 
of how I want the rest of it to go. How do I want my life to unfold? I get to choose abundance, perfection of health, feeling perfect and whole and healthy in my body, feeling in love with my body, feeling in love with my mind and my thoughts and my world. And let's raise that up to the third eye chakra, right in the center of your head. Your third eye chakra goes from the middle of your eyebrows all the way to the back of your head. And it ends at the base of your skull. Let's just see that tunnel of indigo blue opening up and expanding into the world, knowing, being able to see clairvoyantly while your eyes are closed. Let's expand up into the crown, the purple, beautiful crown chakra, the connection to the divine. See a stream of light going straight out the top of your head up to your eighth chakra, which is about three feet above your head, to a gold ball, and then to your ninth chakra, three more feet above that, so six feet above your head, a whole length of a tall person. And those can still feel like you're physically connected to those, even though they're outside your body. There's a realm that you're still connected to there. Just listen again, listen for any guidance from that ninth chakra, that six feet above your head, to see if you can stop and listen for a minute. Feeling so much love around you. How loved you are. How connected you are. Feeling this river now, carrying away anything you no longer need. So let's stay in that space of our ninth chakra and send everything up, up from the body that you no longer need, like butterflies flying up. But these butterflies are gold with purple tips on the ends of their wings. Beautiful gold butterflies. They're like gold leaf with a purple hue at the end. And they're going up into that ninth chakra and then flying out into the river, above the river, along the river, just watching them go down, down, down the river. Anything you no longer need, any extra energy. And with each sound you're hearing in the background, just let that be another thing you no longer need, leaving your body. Excess weight, send it away. Excess toxins, bye-bye. Negative thoughts that don't serve me, thank you and I release you. Words I speak that are not of the purest, highest vibration, I honor you and I let you go out into the water to dissipate out into the world. With each out breath, release a little bit more out the back of your heart now. <sighs> out it goes, back out behind us into a river that's flowing behind us. Breathe in love through the front of your heart and breathe out any pain or unknowing or fear, judgment, guilt out the back. Let's do that two more times, breathe in love. Breathe out fear. Breathe in love. And out. If 
Feel a little swirling whirlpool within your heart, a swirling of energy. And it turns into a beautiful dark blue, kind of a royal blue whirlpool, water whirlpool, swirling in your chest cavity, creating energy, creating more and more and more energy, filling your body up with so much energy, so much determination, but a feeling of peace, a feeling of natural flow, like this is all what's supposed to be happening. Acceptance, allowing, allowing your life to be as it is, loving all parts of yourself for exactly who you are in this moment. Go ahead and rub your hands together till you feel they're warm. Put them over your eyes with gentleness, sending love into your body, into your eyes, so that everything you see today may be beautiful, that you see everything with beauty. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. I hope you have a beautiful, amazing day. May you walk each step with awareness, consciousness, and joy.